Have you ever written with a Pilot Kakuno fountain pen? In case you haven't and you're interested in getting one, we're gonna give you a writing samples today of the three different nib sizes you can get in this Pilot fountain pen. We're gonna start by taking a look at the extra fine nib in this clear colored Pilot Kakuno fountain pen. And this is a pen that we often recommend as a good choice for beginners or people who are just starting out with fountain pens because it's really affordable and it's made by Pilot so you can really depend on the quality and it's really easy to use. As you take a look at um, how the extra fine writes on paper, um, I'll tell you a little bit more about this pen design. Kakuno, the title of this, I mean the name of this pen actually means to write and that's what this pen is designed to do. It's a writer. Each one is fitted with a stainless steel nib, and the caps are a compression cap, so they snap on and off. And on the nib, you'll see there's a smiley face. With the Kakuno, it seems like Pilot was just having a little bit of fun, and they want you to have some fun too. And here's a look at the Pilot Kakuno fine nib. And for these writing samples, we're using a Dominant Industry Takasago um, fountain pen note notebook. And the fine um, is flowing a little bit smoother across the page. Just extra fines, that's pretty typical that they're going to um, be a little bit more scratchy than the wider nibs. And here's the medium. And again, the medium is flowing a little bit more smooth in comparison to that extra fine. Um, but I find it pretty similar to the fine. And by that, I mean they're both pretty smooth on the paper. This is a cartridge converter. We inked it with the ink cartridge included with the pen. And the reason these are great starter fountain pens is one, the price, they're really affordable. Two, they're made by Pilot, so you can just trust that they're gonna be a great option and the, the nib's gonna write, right starting out of the box. They come ready to go. You don't have to go shopping for additional parts and pieces or inks or anything. You can just pop the ink cartridge in and go. And there's tons of colors. Subscribe for more fountain pen tips.